Strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. <laughs> Believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Ah! <laughs> you picked a very good time to show up again, Utger. Thank you. this so much uh, I know it's dangerous but you have to leave the ship and neutralize those pirates I will give you extra reward for that okay we're going EVA guys I found over there. No. No, sir. No. No. Execute order 67. Yes, my lord. No, no. Not 67. Order 66. Execute order 66. Yay! <laughs> they look at you expectant. Note that if Thatcher is looking for romance, she should look no further than her partner. It must be clear to everyone that Eden here is deeply in love with her. Thatcher bursts out laughing. Eden goes bright red. Get lost before I throw you in a cell for disrespecting a magic. <laughs> nice. One less machine. I was also looking at Star Citizen. Maybe you'll try that next week. Very nice, Jim. I've been having fun with it so far, even though I've never left this city, let alone this planet. So, this is my fancy ship that I got with my old AMD R9 video card that I actually started streaming using. And then a few years ago, I upgraded to the 1080 and haven't uh, used it since. But I got this ship at the same time that I got that card. This is a racing ship. It has no cargo capacity at all. So it, it would be very difficult to try to make any money with this. Oh, 
Although, it might be possible to manually stuff some cargo in the back there, I guess. But, uh, yeah, that's about that. Nobody for you to worry about. Nobody at all. Can I free the operative with the spider? No? Shoot. Okay. Don't hunt Loki. Oh my god, she... She hunted Locust and killed her. Not so fast. There we go. And he nails the finish. Spider Man does it again. That's the first time in either of these games that I've actually successfully caught the car. That's, I'm impressed at that. That's pretty cool. folks and welcome back to the library of lore today we are going to be maybe potentially possibly finishing the legend of zelda tears of the kingdom at long last although that said i will not have completed all of the shrines so i'm still going to want to do that uh, so i think we're going to hop right into it tonight i hope everybody's having a fantastic evening i'm definitely having a good one hang on just a second here Wait, oh, oh! Oh, hang on just a second. I have doubled audio. I only need one source. There we go. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so I, I have been doing some off-stream work. And let me just check something really quickly. Travel medallion. Okay, guys. Um, I'm going to pop back home for just a moment because I think I've got some stuff to do at the shrine at home. But I think we are just about ready to attempt the final battle. Here we go. Come on, Link. Uh, nope. Shrine. There we go. You who have conquered the shrines and claimed their lights of blessing, you have four sages' wills. In exchange for four sages' wills, I will make your bond stronger with any sage you choose. I think it's gotta be Yonobo. 
Now I will make your bond with Yunobo stronger. Solemn vow of Yunobo Sage of Fire. The strength and vow of Yunobo Sage of Fire. Your reinforced bond with Yunobo has increased his avatar's attack power. Go and bring peace to the world. <sighs> I'm suddenly hit by an overwhelming urge to delay the inevitable. But, oh god, okay, hang on. Hey, Bob, how's it going? Imprisoning chamber. Uh, I never did find the light route that's supposed to be somewhere around here. Oh, you know what? I forgot. I have this newly acquired and upgraded Gloom Attack Resist Armor that I really need to be using. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I wanted to delay the inevitable. I just remembered why that would be a real good idea. I have not prepared food so that I can recover. So, yeah. Uh, uh, no, wait. Where's, there we go. Okay. Just kidding. Just kidding. We'll go back there in a minute. Just doing some fishing in Warframe? Okay. I don't think I've ever heard of people doing that before, but that's cool. Okay, let's see. No. We need to be cooking. Uh, we can do some of this. was a better recipe. <clears throat> Where is the one? Ah, this is it. Sunny steamed tomatoes. This one's perfect because it heals six hearts, but also restores six gloomed hearts. <laughs> okay, this one heals a little bit extra, but that's fine. Can't seem to not cook this one really, really well, apparently. So how is the Warframe going? I, I have played that game, but only one time, and very, very briefly. It was fun. I enjoyed it, but I never went back to it. Hope you're having a good run with it. Twenty seventeen. I don't know if that was before or after I played it. Oh. 
I'm just gonna spam the hell out of this. I probably should have done it before stream, but I'm gonna... I'm just gonna make as much of this as I possibly can until I run out of ingredients. Or... until I run out of space for cooked meals. The constant battle to find a peaceful place to fish and fighting off enemies to continue my peaceful time is irritating, but I may slowly yet get the fish you need. Now, are those enemies other people? Oh, well, there we go. That didn't take as long as I thought it would. That's a lot of food. Oh, I already had a bunch. I was wrong. Okay, so I do have some anti-gloom food. The only problem here is I don't have a lot of massive healing foods. You know what? I might actually just eat a whole pile of meals so that I have room for extra stuff. I'm not going to need these stamina potions. I can ditch those. And that. And that. I'll leave those. Okay, now I'm gonna focus in on big healing. The enemies are NPCs. There's only one section in Warframe that's PvP and most players just don't do it. Okay, that's not so bad actually. That sounds all right. Uh, do I have hearty anything? I don't think I have any radishes. No, I, okay. I don't know if I'm going to get any of the truly big heals, but I'll do what I can. All right, what kind of good heals do we have that I can actually do? Recipe cards are an easier way to go about this. Full rec Oh, I need truffle for that. That's unfortunate. That's... Uh, wow, okay. I am not really set up for massive healing, am I? I wish truffles were easier to get. They were a lot easier in Breath of the Wild. Hmm. Huh. Well, I'll just do the best I can. It's not bad. 11 hearts. Now granted that was the enhanced version. Regular's not going to be quite that good, but still that, that's still 8 hearts. It's better than most.
Eleven hearts. <clears throat> okay, so we've gotten a few of the elevens. That's not bad at all. I'm surprised my ingredients are holding out so well. Oh, there we go. No, no, hang on. We ran out of something. We ran out of the meat. So I will have to start substituting just regular raw meat. Actually, I will do raw bird thigh. And then we'll go to regular meat. When it's peaceful, mining and fishing? Yeah. I believe that. Okay. Uh, do we have anything else that might... No? Okay. We'll just go regular meat then. Down to seven. Better than nothing. And this will be... Ten. Curious that they... Jim, thank you so much for coming in with the raid. How are you doing? It's so good to see you. What's going on, Jim? Folks, if you don't know Jim Racer, please make sure you go give him a follow. He's been a friend of the channel for a very long time. He plays a lot of sci-fi games and a lot of driving games. What kind of, uh, or specifically racing, I should say. How was your stream tonight, Jim? What's going on? How are you doing? Tell me all about it. Let me get you shout outs. There we go. Ah, Horizon Zero Dawn tonight. You must be getting pretty close to the end of that one, I would think. How's that going for you? That is one of my favorite franchises of all time. That's It's quickly become a real favorite. Doing great. Started, oh, yes, you were going to be starting the Frozen Wilds, and you got to that tonight. That is really awesome. What do you think of it so far? Uh, yeah, so guys, make sure you do go give uh, Jim a follow there. Now, if you are new here, I am Gordon McLeod. I am a narrative streamer here on Twitch. I play a lot of story-based games, either stories that the games themselves present to you or that give you the opportunity to create your own in the form of, you know, strategy and sandbox type games. Been doing a lot of Starfield lately and a lot of Baldur's Gate 3, and we're finishing off, potentially, maybe. We'll see how it goes. We, we may be finishing off The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom tonight. So if any of that sounds good to you, please feel free to hit the follow button. And uh, I do have a little bit of a video to welcome you folks in properly as well. So uh, hopefully it won't scare too many of you away. Welcome. welcome on in, folks. Let's get the stream started, shall we? Whoa! Oh, crap. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, uh, runaway helicopter. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. Oh, shoot. 69. Four factor. 
aspect ratio. Oh, no, 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 no crap. That Let's go for it. Oh. Hey, I have not... I have not looted that, sir. May still be coming, actually. That's a bit of a preview of what you can expect around here. Thank you so much, Jim, for bringing your fine folks over. I really appreciate that. Mad, it's good to see you. Thank you so much for supporting Jim's raid. How are you doing tonight? It's really good to have you here. So uh, I am just cooking up a storm here because we are just about ready. I've been doing some off-stream preparation. Uh, we are just about ready to go and confront Ganondorf and potentially actually finish the game. If we do, I figure... That's probably cause for celebration to, you know, end the playthrough. Not fully. I'm still going to want to finish all of the shrines. But uh, at that point, I think we might switch over to some Starfield. But there's no guarantee that I'm actually going to finish tonight because it's a tough battle. Now, I am much better prepared than I was last time I tried it, but we'll have to see how it goes. You started Starfield last week, really enjoying it. I am so addicted. It's Fallout 4 all over again, only much better. Uh, okay. Hang on a second here. Select for recipe. I want the steam. Oh, I'm out of butter now. That's okay. We can make cheesy steamed potatoes. Or uh, tomatoes, rather. Actually, you know what? It is a little bit weird that the world of Zelda has no potatoes. Huh. Okay, anyway. We're gonna make some cheese stuff. Everything's better with cheese. Oh, that really is better with cheese. That's better, much better healing. That's nine hearts on a regular cook. But sadly, I don't have very much cheese. Oh no, I could do it without the transport, Bob. I just have no intention of doing it again because I already did that maze once. That's why I put the transport thing down. I am not doing that again. Okay. Now I'm out of cheese. We'll try an egg. Twelve. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, now I've run out of meat, but we still have raw bird drumstick. I'm going to run out of space for food again shortly, so we'll use as much of this as we can. Okay. Twelve, not bad. Nope, that's it. That's it. Okay. Let's see how we did. 
I have a little bit of anti-gloom food. Just a bit. And then a whole whack of just pure healing. So hopefully we're okay. And some, you know, uh, gloom warding food. But because I've got the upgraded gloom suit, I'm hoping I won't need that quite as much. And this time Gord actually needs the transport? You mean in Starfield? What do you mean, Bob? I don't have to fast travel in Starfield. Okay. Here we go. Oh, but that... I wouldn't try to avoid that. That's a vehicle. It's not a mount. I have no problem with vehicles. I use them all the time. I drive everywhere in Cyberpunk. By the way, speaking of Cyberpunk, I did pre-order the DLC. I'm not going to play it right away at launch. I'm going to let the bigger streamers have the stage there and I'll start playing it a little later on but I will have it and I will play it because I'm really excited for that one and I, uh, I I posted about this on Discord as well I may potentially be able to get Spider-Man 2 this year as well uh, I don't worry about that kind of stuff Jim Racer but that is potentially a bonus as well oh You guys did not see that. Okay. First attempt. If you thought you saw something, no, you didn't. Gloom's Lair. Speaking of Spider-Man, I read on Twitter last week that the heavy rumor is that the Forbidden West may come to PC sooner than expected, according to a source that's apparently reliable in the past. Well, that is exciting. I know there are a few people in my community in particular who have been waiting on that announcement, so I really hope it's true. And of course, my hands start to sweat. Cobra. We'll see if I'm prepared enough. Link, we 
shall protect Hyrule together. I'll show you in a moment. Okay. Last time I did this fight, I had basically zero arrows. I think I maybe had three or four at most. And I had no real food to speak of. This time, I have come prepared. Uh, I also didn't have the full suit of the uh, suit of the depths, the armor of the depths. Now I've got the full suit and I've got it all upgraded to level two. So I've got the gloom attack resist bonus. Uh, let me just... Okay, I'm not too bad off for bows. Should be okay for weapons. I never use shields. All right. Let's use this. Rude. Oh. Okay. The armor's helping immensely. I'm really not taking the gloom damage I would expect. Ow! Rude. Okay, that was more like I would expect. Let's test this out. Oh, how much is that? That's... That's acceptable. Stop that! Well, I also had no bombs to speak of, either. There we go. Let's try not to run on the root of gloomy death. Okay, not too bad. Oh right, I forgot this is a multi-stage battle. Rude. 
Stop it. Ow. Stupid spitters. Ow. Oh, is it just the one guy left? Last stage. Isn't it? Oh, there we go. Oh, these guys. out of my face. <laughs> yeah, Dazzle Fruit will do it. If you take the time to shoot them... Oh, shoot. Right. If you take the time to shoot them correctly, you can usually one-shot them. Got him. Okay. Yeah, the light fruit are great. That gloom. It means but one thing. The demon king is there. I was so disheartened when this started the uh, last time. Crab Cobra. The rest is up to you. So that's ultra hard mode then. Okay. I'm just gonna. Oh, right. It won't let you save. I hate that so much. Oh, 
Oh, of course they have, Bob. That goes without saying. There's no way they haven't. This is Matt Mercer after too many critical failures, Jim. Any opposition, I will rule. That is what a king must do. Yep, he is, Jim. Yes, he is. Which means I think he's in, like, three of the best games of this year. He's in this. He's in Baldur's Gate 3. You son of a... Crap, I might actually have to use a shield. Hey, I was blocking that time, sir. Take 
It is definitely going better than last time. Oh, uh, thank you, Jarek. I'm gonna wait a bit on that one, though, if you don't mind. Oh, you jerk. Now, I am curious. Oh, it might be helping. Okay. I think it is helping. Just woke up in my chair, so I'm crawling to bed. Okay, I'll do the stretch now then. Ugh, thank you. Kinda needed that. Enjoy your lurk and have a good night. was the wrong button. As I recall correctly, if I recall correctly, uh, last time I did this battle one-on-one -on -one against Ganondorf, he got me down to one heart remaining. Maybe it was two hearts. I'm not sure. It was either one or two hearts remaining. I basically had no way of healing, and then the rest of the battle began. So this is going infinitely better. in my veins. And I am not even near the limits of my power. Yeah, I don't know how to do any of that, Cobra. I'm just gonna wail on him. Well, actually, I do know the flurry rush, but there's no way I'm gonna have time for it. They're here. No, it's okay. I don't want tips. I just want to do the battle. They don't do the gloom damage. I'm going to focus on him. Cheater. Oh, you son of a... Rude. 
I just said I don't want tips, Bob. And I don't understand what those are anyway, so... Believe me, if it gets frustrating enough, I will definitely ask for tips and suggestions. Oh, that wasn't him. <laughs> that was a waste. Oop. Ah! Cheat. Oh. New stage? Yeah, but that's a suggestion, Bob. It's okay. I will ask. I will ask if I need to. Thank you, Cobra. That's encouraging. I like that. Oh yeah, he is down to about half now, isn't he? Ow. Son of a biscuit. That was cheap, sir. You should be ashamed. Okay, what kind of bonus do we get? 430, 430, 430, 4, 520. Ah, uh, you... This, um, wow. My anti-gloom food did not last me nearly as long as I expected it was going to. I don't suppose he'd consider waiting while I do a little cooking. There's no way you dodge that, sir. Oh, shoot. I think my bow broke and I didn't notice.
Have a choice. Oh, this isn't even really good food. Some of it's not the best. How is it break time already? What the heck? Oh, I can actually use some of my regular food. I don't know if the bow is even having any effect on him or not. Three and a half minute warning, guys. Arrows do damage him? Okay. Yeah, okay, they do a little bit. Ow. Ooh. No, I'm gonna save that. Man, I thought I had so much food I was covered. I don't know if I have time for another shot. That's it. That's my last healing. At least my last effective here healing. I don't know if that was more effective or not. It didn't look much more effective. That's true, I could do that. Oh, I do have, man, if ever there was a time.
Okay. This is now a bow fight. <laughs> I forgot all about this. <laughs> Thank you. If I have to try it again, I'll use the arrows a hell of a lot sooner. are in progress. I'll be right back. Trying to deprive me of my... Oh! Oh, damn it, Serana! Oh my god. What do we got? The Amulet of Lost Voices. Speak with dead. The dead hold no secrets from Jurgle Scrivener's of Doom. I love... These oh my god. Chambers. Oh my god. Scriveners of Doom is the best title ever. Whoa! Oh god. Oh, that, uh, um... <laughs> okay. Oh, crap. Oh, no. <laughs> Get back down here. No! Damn it. <laughs> Link? Link, where did you disappear to? I missed my ride. There we go. Oh. There we now we there we go. I was also looking at Star Citizen. Maybe you'll try that next week. Very nice, Jim. I've been having fun with it so far, even though I've never left this city, let alone this planet. So this is my fancy ship that I got with my old AMD R9 video card that I actually started streaming using and then a few years ago I upgraded to the 1080 and haven't uh, used it since but I got this ship at the same time that I got that card this is a racing ship it has no cargo capacity at all so it, it would be very difficult to try to make any money with this Although, it might be possible to manually stuff some cargo in the back there, I guess. But, uh, yeah, that's about that. And now these guys are back. What the hell? There we go. Two for... Okay, sorry about that, guys. I am back. Oh, 
Ah. Is that it? Is that the last? Or is there another stage? There's got to be another stage, right? He hasn't gone horrifically... Go go no, okay. Another stage. Yeah, but that does not imply a third sage. This would be the Dragon of Darkness, I assume. We had the Dragon of Light. This has got to be the Dragon of Darkness. Any minute now. The Dragon of Loading Screens, also a possibility. This is just a Switch, not a Switch OLED. Oh, they're gonna need new castle. That's a shame. Demon Dragon, okay. Oh, I hitched a ride. That's cute. Oh wow, she looks tiny. The final battle of every MCU movie. <laughs> it all comes down to get your enemy down to zero hit points before he does the same to you. Oh, my gloom is gone. That means my food is suddenly useful again.
Uh, jump off. Oh god. Okay. I think I'm now wearing the wrong armor. We probably want the flight suit. Do I have it all? Yeah, okay, it's all upgraded to level two as well. I don't know if I'm close enough for this. I don't think I am. No, I'm missing. Oh, rude. Oh, he's actually taking hearts away? Oh, that's bullcrap. You can land on him? Yeah. Well, I assumed as much. You can land on the other dragons. Oh, uh, she comes and gives me a lift automatically. That's cool. Where's the next thing? Oh, there it is. Oh, I see. Okay, so gloom clothing is actually still good, sort of. Zelda? I need a pick-me-up. Thank you. Okay, you know what? I think I do prefer the wingsuit. It's very useful in this fight. just change. Eh, I don't really care that much what he looks like, honestly.
Stab him in the brain. Oh, I very much doubt it. Until the next curse. It really is, Jim. It really is. I love this. Oh, that's so cool. They came back as forest ghosts. Oh, his arm. Oh, that was so cool. Oh. 
I don't read that as confusion. I read it as amazement and wonderment. <sighs> yeah, if this were real life, they would be splattered. They'd be dead. They might as well have dived into concrete at that point. Stand. I had been sleeping all this time. But when I felt something, like a warm, loving embrace, I woke up. Wow, Cobra then. <laughs> I love the way this game manages to take everything good about Breath of the Wild and turn it into greatness. It's just unbelievable. I love it. Alright guys, we did it. I still have to finish shrines. I've still got a bunch of shrines I have to do. I don't really care about getting all the light roots, but I probably will anyway. But, uh... I'm not going to worry about doing that immediately. We got to the end of the story finally. I'm so happy about that. When it was founded, Bob. Raru and uh, Sonya were the first king and queen of Hyrule.
Have a fantastic night, Jim. Thank you so much for hanging out. Now, as is tradition, whenever we finish a game and it runs credits, we have to watch the credits in full. I've said that Tears of the Kingdom plays, feels like playing Breath of the Wild again for the first time. It really does. I agree. Oh, there's a post credit scene. Excellent. Then we will get to that. I never stop the credits, though. Uh, for those who may not be aware, I used to work in the video game industry. And so I have enormous respect for the people and the amount of work that goes into creating these things. I've never worked on a project anywhere near this big. So, uh, you know, we always have to watch the credits whenever we get to the end of a game that has them. I even watched to the very end of the credits of Horizon Zero, or uh, Forbidden West, which are the longest credits I have ever watched. They clocked in at an entire hour. The previous record holder was Spider-Man Miles Morales, which was a good 40 to 45 minutes. It doesn't look like these will be quite as long because they are being very kind and doing multi-column credits when necessary. So hopefully it won't take a million years. Five to ten minutes is not a problem. That's easy. Then once the credits are done, I will make sure that I've got a saved game because I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to want to finish all the shrines eventually over time. And uh, then we will probably switch over and do some Starfield because I'm still horribly addicted to that one. And I don't want to do Baldur's Gate yet because there are reportedly some problems with the PlayStation 5 version of it. I know I could technically play it on PC, but I really like the PS5 version. So I'm just going to wait until the patch comes down for PS5, and then we'll go ahead with that again. But until then, we're just going to play Starfield. Yeah, I'm hoping this uh, whole concept of doing multi-column credits really takes off and other studios use it, because an hour was an awful lot. If we start running into more games that have credits of that length, I might have to reconsider my policy of watching all the credits. Because respect to the devs is one thing, but I also have to respect the stream and the audience, so... Sometimes it stutters when loading an area ahead of you, but it's like one second. That's okay. It's a thin excuse to play Starfield anyway. Yeah, I, that's what I assumed, Cobra. I'm going to use that as an excuse to not play it for a few days until, like, I think the patch is supposed to come down on Friday anyway. So I'll just wait until then. And until then, I have an excuse to play Starfield. So it, it's fine. So when we do switch over and do Starfield, what we're going to do is I'm going to stop the stream, but only for like 10 seconds, just so that there's a split in the VOD and I can upload Tears of the Kingdom and Starfield as separate files. Otherwise, I have to go in and re-render the stream and it's all just a whole thing that I don't want to have to deal with. Really neat. Yeah, I'm kind of thinking after finally I guess this is now the second Zelda game I've ever finished. I finished Breath of the Wild. I finished this one. I might one day go back and play some of the older ones. I have played a few of them, but I've never finished any of them. Like, I played the original. I played a little bit of Four Sword Adventures. And I played a fair bit of Wind Waker, but I never finished that one. So if they ever bring 
Wind Waker to the Switch or to the upcoming Switch successor console. That'll probably get me to do it. Oh, the English voice cast. There's a few familiar looking names in there. Obviously, Matt Mercer. None that I'm super familiar with, but Matt Mercer, obviously. I mean, he's pretty unmistakable. The only one I technically got most of the way through was Wind Waker, which is cute and fun. It was really fun. I really loved the ocean-going mechanic, the sailing. That was my jam. I would play that again in a heartbeat if it came out on a modern console. I've kind of drifted off from doing the retro games, but I'm still interested in doing them, and that would definitely get me back on retro console gaming. Nope, it is not on Switch. It is one of the most highly requested Zelda titles on Switch. Nope, never has been. Um, special thanks. I guess you're right. It's got to be almost done. Yes, Ocarina and Majora's Mask are both on Switch, but Wind Waker is not. I'm not really familiar with Skyward Sword. I've heard of it, that's about all I can say. Was incredible. What a game. The end, except for the post credits bit. Oh, no, okay. I guess that one scene was the last of it. Okay, guys. 
Now, unfortunately, when I stop the stream, what's going to happen is I'm going to pop it back on and we're going to have to do a really quick break. So instead of stopping and doing a break when I actually end, um, I'll just wait until Twitch insists on running ads again. Uh, there doesn't seem to be. I'll do continue and see if anything happens. Maybe it's only if you cer uh, if you meet certain conditions, Cobra. If you've done certain content, which is maybe another potential reason to come back to that at some point. Demon King Ganondorf's profile has been added. Okay, so let's just make sure we've got this saved at this point. And we will move on. Uh, no, I did not do any of the Deku Tree stuff. I never figured that out. So that's another thing. When we eventually come back to this, we'll maybe do some additional story content as well as the shrines and stuff like that. Because there are plenty of side quests I never did. Uh, okay, so if you guys will give me 10 seconds, I'm just going to stop the stream really quickly. Then we'll have to take an early break. I swear I'm not doing it for the money. The ad breaks really don't bring in enough money to justify, you know, running extra breaks to take advantage of it. Uh, and then we